I think we both need a break from her. How do we successfully have a poly relationship and we ain't on point? I don't understand that. Trying to force me to do something that you want to do, I don't want to do that lame ass shit. I don't. What's she lame? ain't even on my level. Like that's just so real. How do you are confused? You can go. You can leave. Touch my shit. You can leave. I'm not going nowhere. Like, just because you tell me to leave doesn't mean I'm gonna just leave the house. I'm not gonna I'm not calling nobody. I'm not calling you. You understand? Yeah, it's fine. Because what you don't understand is I never even got a bug from her. What are you talking about? Why are you chasing me? Yeah, get out. Let's go. Why are you chasing me? Why are you chasing me? Why are you chasing me? I know y'all are wondering what happened. What's going on? Is she pregnant? Is she not pregnant? I know y'all got all these questions. So I'm here to tell you guys that. <sighs> what's up you guys welcome back to season three of try love oh my god i know season two ended off so crazy i know y'all are wondering what happened what's going on is she pregnant is she not pregnant i know y'all got all these questions so i'm here to tell you guys that <sighs> she is not pregnant okay and and no shade or whatever towards her yeah we all thought she was pregnant the situation was very very touchy very very sensitive whatever case may be i ain't gonna lie i'm actually relieved that she isn't pregnant because it it, it was just the way that things were thrown around in my face honestly i don't think i was 100 percent ready although i may have said plenty of times i would be okay with the pregnancy from her and then honestly let's be real since i have struggled with having babies and stuff like that me and Flo have talked about having a surrogate or whatever case may be. And obviously, if, if it was a surrogate, I would want it to be somebody that I know, somebody that I trust. Unfortunately, with her being pregnant, they made this situation so, like, traumatizing, so fucking, like, negative. And it's almost like, damn, a nightmare. Like, it's a nightmare to me. Like, every time I think about it, it disgusts me the way that they just carry things along. And I don't think I could ever really... And I'm trying to get over it. I'm trying to just be cool. I'm trying to just get back to Leia. Honestly, it just put me in a really bad space with both of them. Um, but it also is a relief that she's not pregnant. So me and Flo can possibly possibly move on from this. I don't know. Um, but I need to get a break. I need to get away. I need to just get my mind clear, think about some things, you know, and just just kind of get my mind off this. And I just, I, I really just need to get away. <sighs> I'm not gonna lie. Things haven't really been the same since the whole pregnancy thing, it completely threw the whole relationship off. It's got me and Leia doing all this arguing. It's just, I hate arguing about something that's outside of our relationship. You know, okay, yeah, I acted kind of stupid when she was pregnant. Yeah, I was doing too much. But it's like, why we gotta keep carrying on and arguing? It got so serious that Leia had to go and leave town. Now I'm leaving you all that shit. Like, come on, yo. Are you really gonna take it that far? I feel like it's unacceptable. Like, we can, we can figure this shit out. So in the process of all of this stuff going on, after we found out that the pregnancy test was not accurate as far as, you know, what we took on the P test or whatever, we got a doctor's test, it did not come back positive. Um, you know, things got kind of heated after that. Yans was pretty much, you know, felt like she was just in the middle of a bunch of like drama and she just kind of wanted to get away, go back home, which is totally respectable. I also advise that maybe she should get away for a little bit just you know, for me and Flo to just figure out things and just really just get back to what we were before. Cause honestly, at the end of the day, it's me and Flo first. And I feel like, you know, I wouldn't want her to feel uncomfortable around this situation. You know, just, I just don't think it was fair for her. So she agreed, she went back home, back to Atlanta. And that's just kind of where we are right now. So I get back home. I'm finally back home because I needed my break. I needed, I just had to absolutely get away from this mess. So I get back and um, I'm just like, I'm happy to be home. You know what I'm saying? I'm happy to be home. I just want to relax. Just, you know, just kind of get back to my normal life. 
And Flo is like in the kitchen and he's just literally just like automatically just jumping on me. I'm just like, oh God, here we go. That's like we didn't already talk about. Everything. I just want to relax. I don't want to do it. Well, can I at least get a hug? Like a real hug? <sighs> okay. Oh my God. No, no, no. no. Good. How was your fight? Come here. Come here. What? I'm hot and I want to change. Ooh. Man, you looking good, girl. I miss you. You miss me? Can I change? You can change in front of me? I don't want to change. Definitely not want to do that. No, I'm just saying, like, how was your fight? You I miss? just told you it was good. Dang. But you didn't miss me, though? Mm. What you mean you don't know? How can you leave town and not miss me? She was thinking about somebody else? Do you think you were me? Was I? Think about you, girl. Yeah. Look, I just want to tell you that, like, I'm really sorry for what I didn't happen. I know I've told you a bunch of times on the phone, but I feel really bad about the way I treated you. I just want you to tell, like, tell you that I'm really sorry, baby. Right. Just get on my face. You're gonna let me talk to you? I just wanna change. I just got off a of, flight. Of, I don't wanna hear all that right now. So honestly, like, I'm tired of arguing. I feel like I've expressed myself enough to him. He's very, you know, remorseful. He's very apologetic. He's seems like he just kind of want to just put it all behind us and just move forward. And I'm all for it. Like, we built all of this up, honestly, at the end of the day. Like, I feel like it'll always be Princess and Flo. I'm not finna let anybody come in between me and what me and my man done built over all these years. Like, be the fuck for real. How come you didn't want to change in front of me? Because I want to get on the bathroom. And this outfit is not, it's just something to throw on. I know, but I'm just saying, like, why are you acting that, that funny to the point where you don't even want to change in front of me? Like, you left town, so I'm not even broke up. So, um, I'm kind of hungry. Huh? I'm not acting funny. You're acting super funny. Don't be annoying. Look, let's just talk about this. What are you upset about? Explain to me exactly what you're upset about. Because I, I don't Seriously. want. Seriously. I'm saying I don't want this shit to drag. I'm not gonna out. keep repeating myself. You already know what I'm upset about. Like, let's be the fuck for real. Like, I know what I'm you're. Not, I'm not gonna. Why keep are you repeating? still upset? Like, why do I have to keep repeating myself? You should understand how I feel. If you don't understand how I feel, then we don't need to do this. Just start off. I want to tell you that I apologize. Just listen, don't, don't do that. Like, listen to what all I'm right, saying. all right. I'm hearing you. What? I want to apologize for the way I was acting. I was extra. I didn't have to do all the stuff I did. I mean, I was excited. Like, look, we, we were trying to have a baby. We tried multiple times. So I was just excited. Like, is it really something? And you wrong? only, and, yeah, because you only cared about you being excited. Like, what about me? At the end of the day, what about me? Y'all both was doing that dumb ass shit. Like, well, I thought doing you were... extra stuff. Stuff that you never did with me. Rubbing feet, going to the store, buying baby clothes. Y'all, you never did that with me. So it's like, why? And I'm just so tired of talking about this. Like, what is we going to do? Like, I'll just, at this point, I'm just so tired of I know, but, but look, you just can't. You went out of town, you came home, and you're still upset about the same thing. We're still talking about Okay, it. I just want to relax. I don't want to be attacked as soon as I come through the door with all this. I, I just don't. I okay, but I don't want this vibe to keep carrying over. Like, we need to just get it in the past. Let's just well, get I, I, unfortunately, it's gonna take me some time to get just get over it. It's not just an easy. Oh, just get over it. No, fuck no. Like I'm a human being. I'm not. But just I'm gonna, saying you just left town. Like what, what time? And you had time to yourself to. to okay, think so about there's it. a. I have. There's a time limit on when I can heal on when I'm supposed to heal. Like what? what since when do we do that? I'm not saying there's a time limit. I'm just saying we got a lot of stuff going on. Okay, I don't give a fuck about nothing else. I care about my. Have you asked me if was I okay? My mental health. Like I asked you when you walked in the door. How how were you doing? How, how, you asked me how was my flight, not how was I doing. Okay, well, you how, care more about the flight than me. Well, I mean, that's life or death. Anyways, died. okay. That's what I'm talking about. Look, look. This is what I want to know. Like, how are you doing? Like, you good? How do you feel? Like, I, we haven't really talked while you're out of town. You weren't really answering the phone that much. How do you feel? I really don't even know, to be honest with you. You don't know how you feel. Mm -mm. I'm just here. I'm just existing, taking it day by day. I mean, look, you still upset me about everything. I'm 
more so disappointed and hurt because it's like the guy that I accepted a, a proposal from that's supposed to be my fiance, like literally just treated me like shit for the next bitch. Yeah, at this point, the next bitch, because like I, I would have never thought that both of y'all would have acted like that towards me. And I get it. I get the excitement. That's fine. I could have been excited I mean, too, but y'all didn't even allow me that. So, so y'all just threw everything in my face, just was doing all this extra shit that didn't was not even necessary. Like. So you don't feel like I had any right to be excited? I never said you didn't. But it's a way that you do things. Okay, I know I did too much. When I was watching those videos, I was like, okay. okay. So it took you to watch the videos. To I mean, sometimes when we're I was in the... stuff the whole time and you wasn't even listening. Okay, sometimes when you're in the moment, you don't always see the full the full perspective. You don't see it. Like I had to look at it from the outside looking in. I was like, okay, I was doing too much. I didn't really have to go baby shopping. I mean, what's wrong with rubbing her feet? I mean, rub, never, I mean, I'm rubbing her pussy, but what's, what's the difference? Because you never rub my feet even when I ask you on a regular day when Girl, I was pregnant time. those two times. Why the fuck you don't? No, let's be the fuck for her. You know, you barely rub my back. Like, stop. Let's stop the bullshit. I, I, no, you don't. No, you do not. Yes, I do. No, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. Barely. I ask you to rub my feet, rub my back, you on the game. You doing something else. But the moment she, oh, <laughs> you want to be rubbing on some crusty ass feet. So stop playing with me in my face. Don't do that. I've rubbed, I've rubbed your back almost Boy, every day. Anyways, I rub your back almost every ass, day. The more lame ass measly. Girl, you be asking me when I'm half asleep, rub your back. I'm like, I want to sleep. So we're going to argue about that? Really? Okay, I'll rub your back more. Whatever. I don't even want it at this point. I don't care. That's what you don't care. I don't. So I that's, don't that, that, that's where you're at right I now. I don't want it. I can go to you massage him and give me a, a, a back massage and foot massage. $59. I'm good. I can do that. But I want to do it for you. I don't want you to feel Well, I need you to act like you want to do it for me. You know, show some initiative. Like with her, why? She didn't have to ask. You just, oh, rubbing feet. So it's like, and I'm, I'm just so tired of talking about it. It is what it is. You feel the way you feel. I feel the way that I feel. This is where we at with it. So what's next? <sighs> what can I do to, to make things better? Like what, what is it that I can do to fix this? Because I mean, I don't know what to do. I'm trying to apologize to you. I'm trying to tell you how I feel. I'm trying to tell you that I want to do what I got to do to fix this. What, what can I do? Like, what do you expect from me right now? I just feel like if we really want to be successful with this relationship and actually work on this relationship, we need to go back to square one and focus on us. And I think that y'all's being in Atlanta right now is probably a good thing. And maybe she should just stay there because I just feel like it was just too much going on. And even on her part, it's like still no apology, still no, you know, just nothing. But, but, so you think that we should just cut her off? I never said just cut her off, but I think we need a break from things. Just like I went and got a break, she's there. I think we both need a break from her. What are you thinking about? I just, I didn't think that was necessary. Like, what's my, why, would, why wouldn't it be necessary? So you want to work on this relationship, right? Well, it's, You understand that things can never work unless we work out first. But I'm saying it's, it's a relationship that involves all three of us. Yeah, but it was that the foundation is me and you. Okay. So how do we make something work with all three of us with any extra person if me and you ain't on point? We can all three do it together. Leia really wants to just leave Jans in Atlanta. Like, why? Like, wh what did she do that was so bad? Okay, whatever. She was pregnant. We, we overreacted. But why would we have to just leave her in Atlanta? I feel like this completely overreacted. Like, there's no reason that we have to cut Jans off because of the situation. Like, I don't feel like it's necessary. Like, we can work this out. Why would we need to cut her off and just leave her in Atlanta? I'm trying to be understanding. I'm trying to be accepting, whatever the case may be. Um, but then it's just like, Flo don't really seem like he know what he want. It's like, I'm expressing to him how I feel and what I want. I straight up just told him I really don't think that Yan should come back. He just keeps bringing up the fact that Yan should come back. I'm just like, bro, if you really want us to work, we need to cut her out of the picture at least for a while until we figure out us. Get back to us, you know? And he just not getting that, so. You sound dumb as fuck. I, I, I'm just not. No. What you mean? I'm wait, good. wait, just wait. No, nah, no. Nah, so, so basically, what you're saying is you want her back here. You want her to come back. I'm, I'm not against it. So you don't want to work on this with it. You want to work as a three thing, and that's just it. That's what it is. The part of I understand shit. that. But so, what happened to Princess and Flo? What happened to what we got going? What happened to what we're building to? No, we are gonna work on that. How do we? How do we successfully have a poly relationship and we ain't on point? I don't understand that. That's what I'm trying to talk to you right now. Let's get on point today or whatever, and then we'll bring her back tomorrow. I'm, I'm not doing hey, this. come on. Man, what what are you out. tripping about? So I'm not going to be tomorrow. You asked me what I wanted. You asked me what do I think would take to make this relationship work. I'm telling you, we need a break from her. And you sit up here and 
in my face telling me you want her back tomorrow? Are you being fucking for real right now? I should have said tomorrow, but like next no, week. No, no, no. So, so you want her back ASAP, Becky? You want her to just I walk think, back up in this bitch like. We, we, we've been building this whole relationship. What, why we want to mess it up now? Like, she, we thought she was pregnant, whatever. We think we're awkward. We work on it together. What? How about you go and work it out with her? Because I'm not doing that. How about you go and you work it out? You, you do that. Because obviously you care more about that than no. you care about what we got going on. That's not what I said. Yeah, that is what you're saying to me. No, I'm saying. That is what you're saying. Okay, we don't have to bring her back right away. We can wait for her. But why does she have to come? Like, why does it have to be a timeout on when she comes back? We need to heal first before we bring anything back into the relationship, whether it's her or whoever. So are you trying to tell me you don't want to be in a relationship first? If I didn't want to be in a relationship with her, so what? If I didn't, I'm asking her. you if you want okay, to. Okay, no, I don't. And, and now what? I don't. So what do you want? You still want to be with her? I, I mean, I, I don't know. You didn't never tell me this. is the first time you're expressing this to me. Okay, well, I'm telling you now. So what? You want us to be with her? I want us to be with her. I don't want to be with her. So I, if us, it ain't no us if I don't want to do it. So what you want to do? Well, why don't you want to do it? Because I have my reasons why. Well, tell me the reason. It ain't about that. I'm asking you what's your reasons. Why do you want to? Why do you want to? Because we've been building all this together. Tell like, what? What have we built? If anything, we've torn down. What have we built? What tore down? What the fuck have we built? Tell me one thing that tore down. Tell me one thing that we built. Tell me one thing that we built. Because if anything, we done spent money, money going out the door. We done spent hella bands on the girl. We done spent time trying to build something that really ain't went nowhere but here. So what have we built? Tell me. We're in the, pro me. We're in the process of building something. Tell me. What? I just feel like you're overreacting. You're overreacting. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm always the one. I'm always the one that's overreacting. You are overreacting. I'm right here. So, so I'm tell me how you're not overreacting. I'm what, what's the big deal? I'm always the one that's overreacting. Okay, so she thought she had. That's why I let this bitch the first time, because I'm overreacting. So how about overreacting? Okay, I, listen to me. I, I overreact. How, okay. This is overreacting. That's overreacting. You can take that back. See, I wore that the whole time when I was young. Whole time. Still being lost, shut on motherfuckers that I'm married and I'm about to get married. To your stupid ass. Put your reason. I'm not doing no. I'm not doing. Why not? Because I'm not. Put Give your, me a reason. Put, and you still haven't told me the re what are we building? Here. What are we building? Could, what are we building? What are we building? Nothing. How do you build something that can't be built? Be 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 for real. Like. <sighs> you just like no. <sighs> you just it's just always me. It's always Leia. It's always Princess. Sid. It's always Princess is jealous. It's always Princess has got a problem with something. Da, 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 da. But when I, I sit up here and I let this whole shit. Happened in the first goddamn place. If it wasn't for me, you wouldn't have shit. So let's be the what fuck for real. What do you mean? What are you saying? You heard what I said. Girl. You or her would not be shit without me. Let's be the fuck for real. So no. you're trying to, you know what? I'm not even getting that conversation. That's straight fucking bullshit. And, uh, and, no, it's real shit. It's real. Listen, this is this is getting too serious. Come no, here. No, no. Come here. Come put your ring back on. Come put your, just come here. It's not you. Put your ring back on. Come here. Put your ring back on. Don't be just taking your ring off for no reason. That's fucking fucked up. Put your ring Let's put this shit down. I'm, I'm trying to, come on, man. I ain't eat nothing today. Right, you you going to feed me? You going to take me out to lunch? Take me out to dinner? But I just feel like, look, I'll take you out to dinner because I want to talk to you about the situation. I really, I'm so tired of talking about the same thing over and over. I'm just so exhausted. I so, feel great to come back home, not to deal with this shit. Don't you feel no like more. we should at least sit down and talk to you and see what we can do to work it out? What about what? Just, about what? I mean, give her a chance I don't, to I haven't even gotten an apology. I'm not giving nobody no chance to do Nothing. You showed me where you stand at. She showed me where she stood at. No phone calls, no text messages, no nothing. Nothing. Maybe she just, I mean, you, you And you steady trying to defend her. No, I'm saying, look, like you always let's trying be to real. defend no, no, her. No, hold on. Let's be real. We have we she got awkward. We kept asking her if, if she was messing with somebody else. We kept putting pressure on her. She left town. She probably don't know what's going on. It's an awkward situation. I bet you've been talking to her though. I haven't talked to her at all. So what, you think I'd be talking to her behind your back? Girl, I've never done that. Don't try me that bullshit. So why are you going so hard to get her back here? I feel like, I just, I, I don't feel like what happened is a good enough reason to cut her off. It is definitely. I feel uncomfortable in my very own house. Because every time I walk around, I got to walk on eggshells. Oh, because Yonza's pregnant. Oh, because Okay, but she's not pregnant. Okay, but I'm telling you, before we left here, that was the case. It was, oh. Oh, you got you can't treat her that way. You gotta be um mindful of her. And feelings. if you were pregnant, and I, and I can't even be comfortable in my own fucking house. If, so yeah. if you were pregnant, I would have had her doing the same shit. So yeah, what are you talking about? Right. I guess so I would have. I would have told her to sweep. I would have been giving you a foot massage, all that. You don't but believe? But you never me? done that before. You never you didn't do that before. But she never done before. You have to think about it exactly. 
I'm a, I mean, I'm a different man. I'm a different man. Oh, now you're different. You're different for the next one. No, I'm just saying I've grown. I'm, I'm different now. I feel like now, if you were pregnant now, I would have did that. Well, you can't that compare who I was. That was a year ago. What? What? what People what? change. I wasn't the same person yesterday. People change. You, 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 you got. You, you just. Ooh, I'm you trying. Just to, you've been trying to help me become you, a better you, person. You, you, you disgust the fuck out of me. I just can't. I'm good. <sighs> just come here, man. <sighs> Look, can you at least just accept my apology? I'm sorry for mistreating you. Girl, don't talk to me. Why are you texting somebody? Why should I? Oh, I'm trying to hear nothing you got to say. Because when I was talking, you ain't, you ain't listening to me. So now you want me to, now you want attention. Now you want to give me attention. I don't want to give you attention. I just, I just feel bad about everything that happened. And I feel like, in all reality, we could work this out. Okay, honest. so I... Stop bringing her up. I'm trying to focus on us. If you bring her up one more time, I'm so, I'm serious. Like, I'm so over it. I'm so over it. So you just straight up hate her. I never said I hated anybody. I don't have any hate in my heart for nobody. So I need a I break. Know. I all right. Babe, just chill. Like, come here. Let's just let's just work on things for the next week or two, and then we'll just tell Yon to come back. What if I'm not ready to do it in a week or two? Whatever. Three weeks. Well, get the fuck off of me. What? Why do I always get a time limit? Why do I always get a... a no, I'm just saying, I, 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 like, I'm we don't like, have to cut her off. We can just take some time and just... I, what it. if I don't want to take... What if I don't... I, what if I want to just cut her off? What, what if I just... I don't want to cut her off. Why? I don't want to. Give me a reason why. I don't need a reason. Give me a reason why. Why are you sitting up here in my face and not being honest? Why, Tell do, I, me why, why? do I need a reason? <laughs> okay. We'll yeah. go be with her then. You go be with her then. No, I'm serious. You don't want to cut her off. You go get your ass out and go. You go be with her then. Go! I'm saying, no, you go. She ain't Atlanta. No, no, no. I, I, I don't want to do that. You can go and be with her. Go ahead. I'm not saying. I don't that. want to hear nothing else you got to say. You can go and be with her. That's what you just told me in my face. You still want to be with her. You still want to be no, with her. So you go be with her then. You go. You go. You go. I don't want to hear nothing else you got to say. Listen. I don't want to hear nothing else you got to say. You can go be with her. You understand what I'm saying? I don't want to hear nothing else. You you can go be with her. You want me to help you? I can take your stuff. You can pack your stuff Listen. up real nice and neat, and we can go. I can, whatever. Oh, we can go. No, you we can, can go. I we can, I, I'm not I going, never said I'm not I want to. No hey, stop. What just you? stop talking to me. Okay. I never said, just stop. So I'm just so sick of hearing about Yon's this, Yon's that. Like, I feel like a lot of this was already thrown in my face enough. I want to just get home, be comfortable in my own home. Like, I just feel like the whole time, like, motherfuckers made me feel uncomfortable in my own home. Like, I had to, like, prance around on eggshells for this Yon's. So at this point, I just want to come back home to my peaceful house and just relax and get back to normal. And this is the fact, like, it, it, it just seems like we can never just get away from this. So at this point, if he want to go and be with y'all, he can go and do that. But that's not just what I want to do right now. I don't. I honestly don't. And I have my reasons why I don't want to do that. If he don't respect those reasons, then, baby, there's the door. Like, what the fuck are we doing? I never said I want to be with her. I said I want us to be with her. I don't want to be with her. She obviously is not ready for a poly relationship. She's not built for this shit. Let's be for real. She's not. Okay? So I don't want to be with her. I'd rather just be me and you for now. We focus on us and we work on that. And whatever happens next, we work on that. But I'm not focused on being with nobody right now. Because obviously we're not here. We're not good right now. Okay? I think we're perfectly fine. All right, well, I don't. Just chill. You're overreacting. You're doing too fucking much. And that's it. You're doing too fucking much, and that's the reason why we're here right now. Oh, big deal. I was doing whatever. I was treating her because she was pregnant, treating her nice. Who cares? You tripping. There's nothing funny about it. Just get over it, lady. It ain't that big of a deal. That's what I'm talking about. Just get over it. How about I just get over you? I should have never came back to this bitch. I should have never came back in this bitch. Cause you want to still be with her, so you go be with no, her. No, I want us to be I, with her. I don't, I can tell you, I don't want to be with her. So you go be with her then. God damn. Trying to force me to do something that you want to do. I don't want to do that lame ass shit. I don't. What's she lame? ain't even on my level. Like, let's be the fuck for real. She's not built for this shit. I keep trying to tell you that. You want to go be with her, you go be with her. You can marry her. Here, give her this ring. Give, give Girl, stop taking No, I'm serious. Break. Like, I'm sick of hearing this shit, bro. Move. Like, you lame as fuck for that shit. Don't bring that shit up again. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to do it. I didn't say that. You I, can go and you can go be with her. Let me help you. I don't want to be with Let her. Let me help you. You uh, are tripping. Y'all can work on all 
I manifest shit that I helped you with, that I, I designed. You can get yeah, up. Yeah, yeah, I definitely designed this whole logo. Get the fuck up out of here, and I bet you she could never do no shit like that. Who said that you I designed that? I did. I said. Who? Cause I ain't going no fucking where. This is my fucking house. Girl, stop messing with my shit. No, you get out of here. What stop, the fuck you girl, mean? Get off my shit. Bye. I'm not going nowhere. Bye. The fuck is wrong with you? Bye. Get out of my closet. Stop. Bye. Get out of my fucking closet. Why? Cause guess what? I had time to get away and think about what I wanted. You get some time to get away and think about what you want. Cause clearly I was you're here by myself. Clearly you are confused. You can go. You can leave. You can leave. I'm not going nowhere. Well, bye. Yes, you are. Bye. That's it. I'm done. I'm done. We can figure this out. I'm not figuring shit out. Because one plus one ain't equal to two for you. So let's get the fuck on up out of here. Come on. This is what you want. Let's go. This is what you want. This is not what I want. I did not sign up for none of this bullshit. What you mean? This is not what I, I'm not going to take no more disrespect from nobody. You what, what's disrespectful about Well, you, you, you disrespect me. And you allow the next to disrespect me too. So if that's the case, we finna, let's go. Come on. Yeah, put your little raggedy ass shoes on, come on. I'm not going nowhere. Like, just because you tell me to leave doesn't mean I'm gonna just leave the house. Like, you're overreacting, you're making too big of a deal about you're telling me to leave? You just got back in town, you literally just got back. Why should I leave? Like, what do you need me to leave for? We can talk this out, you're doing too much. I'm not doing I'm packing the fucking bag. Cause you don't, do you understand I can get any man that I want? I don't gotta do this. I do not have to do Shut it. Shut the hell up. Like, yeah, and you know that. So I, guess I, I what? Any girl I want, she, man. But all right, well, go get him then. Go get him. I'm just saying. What are you go saying? What the fuck and are you ain't saying? No, ain't no any girl you want going to be equal to this. So let's be real. Go ahead. Not everybody you going against can be equal to this. Who ain't? Who ain't? Huh. Oh, so at least I know how you feel then. Yeah. Fuck out of here then. You know what? I'm going to leave. And at least I know how you feel Dude, you stop talking. At least I stop know how you feel talking. too. Stop fucking talking to me, lady. Yeah. Don't say shit to me. Nah, I can't. Ah, okay. No, I'm just, I'm over you right now. Oh, I'm cool. Just fuck out of here. Finally, you're over me. No, yes. stop talking to me. Yay, you're over me. <laughs> Mission accomplished. Girl, shut the fuck up. Yeah. Oh, he's upset. Now you see how I feel. Woo! Oh, I hope so. I think you're acting like you tripping. Let's I'm not doing too much. I'm going to get the fuck out of here. All right, bye. Anywhere. I'm not going with her. What the fuck are you talking about? I never said that. Stop saying that. I felt like we could work shit out. I don't want to work a goddamn thing out. I definitely don't. I guess I'm gonna just leave. I mean, it's whatever. I mean, she she wants her space. She's one of those girls who just, when she needs her space, you gotta give it to her. So I'm gonna just leave, give her some time. And I'm sure when I get back, it'll, it'll blow over. It shouldn't be that big of a deal. We, we talked a little bit on the phone while she was in Atlanta, so I felt like we weren't gonna fight like that. But you know what we did? That's who we are. It's gonna be good. I'm not about to spend another day, another dollar on that bullshit. On what? On that bullshit. Bye. You was making your way out the door. Come on, I'll help you. Let's go. Look, let's, just, let's just. I don't want to do it. Look, if you bring that up one more time, I swear to God, I don't want to do okay, it. Okay, look, this is what we'll do, all right? Let's just call the arms and just. I'm not gonna. I'm not calling nobody. Let's just see what she's saying. I'm not calling you. You, you know, know what this is? Yeah, this fucking bitch. What you know? Yeah, Told me to. I'm leaving because I want to leave. Yeah, she's yeah. Fuck up. Don't come back. I'll change the locks. So he leaves out of the door, child. He mad, turning red in the face. Girl, I don't give a fuck.